Roads in Europe are some of the most diverse in the world, uh, from uneven surfaces to extremely tight alleyways, steep curves, slopes, and many other unpredictable hurdles. I'm looking forward to seeing how the i30 performs on these exceptional European roads. I'm very excited. These bumpy roads tell me that I'm in Europe. Yet I couldn't feel any fluctuation or noise. This is because of the improvement of stiffness design. I was speeding up aggressively entering the corner and there was almost no body roll. The car knows how to handle the road and this is due to the well-balanced spring and damper combination. There was almost no understeer under acceleration. The impression I got from the steering is it was very fast and precise. The brakes were very responsive. Even when repeatedly using them at high speed, there was no overheating or deterioration. The brakes were stable and consistent. Low and mid-range torque was really nice. In fact, the maximum torque is at 1500 RPM. The engine power was really smooth and precise and it meant overtaking was a breeze. This is due to the turbocharger system, which is similar to what we also use in the WRC. It's built for comfort. We can cruise the, the mountain roads uh, in Spain, enjoying the views uh, on a sunset, and we can also go racing with the car at the racetrack. Um, it's, you know, it's what driving's all about.